Cool. You happy? Okay, well, nice. Congratulations to Gold for the strange way to win it. When did you become aware that your opponent wasn't showing up? Um, it was about five minutes before I was due to go down, really. Um, I just come out to check how Bianca was doing. Um, and then someone told me, but I've had it before, so I, I went and checked myself, and uh, it was true. But um, yeah, it's disappointing to win, win that way. It would have been a good final. I think he's a good player, but he, he said to me he's got like the Asian qualifiers for the Olympics in three weeks' time, so he was looking after himself. Um, but you did go through the motions quite a bit earlier on in the quarterfinals and uh, the semi-finals. Semi-finals was so close, but go through the quarterfinals first. And, uh, uh, yeah, the, the quarters, um, I had a game plan, but I had injured my ankle in the fight before on my left, so it, it basically took my weapons away and I had to play kind of his game. So I was just trying to keep her as tight as possible. Um, he's, a, he's a really good player, I, fought him, I think that's the fifth time now. I fought him and it's three two to me now. <laughs> so I'm happy about that. But yeah, it was a um, it was a tough one and then going into the sudden death it was just like a, a game of chess for like thirty seconds. I was trying to get him to come to me, he was trying to get me to go to him and he just made one mistake and I, I just punched um, as hard as I could to get the to get the point really. And then at the end of the semi-final, there was quite sort of a delay because it looked like you got three points and it was two, it was one. Yeah, um, well I, I knew what was going on. I, the, the judges just made a mess of it really. I, I, I back kicked them and it went, it was 5-4 to him and it went 6-5 to me. And he was like two seconds left, um, but they put a headshot on instead. So it was just getting that sorted really. And with the, the, it shouldn't have took that long, but with the system, they were trying to put her on. and. But uh, we both knew what the score was, mm -hmm. and um, it was just a matter of getting it right and f fighting that last two seconds, which I had to just make sure not not go out of the ring and get another warning. How difficult has it been for the athletes with sort of the, the new technology and everything that's come in and things that are being trialled out? Um, I think if they stuck to one, it'd be fine. But it's uh, for me it, the hardest thing is it's being Dado, it's being Lajust, it's being Adidas um, a couple of years ago. So it's like you get used to doing one, which this year I've done really good on. Lajust, I've changed my game and adapted to Lajust. Um, and then we come here and it's Dado and find out the Olympics have got Dado. Um, but I've prepared well, even though um, I haven't fought since the World Championships, I've prepared really well. And um, it's it's paid off here today, it's just the, the pr preparation of um, using the system in the gym and getting used to it. We obviously know that the, the World Championships went uh, well for you and obviously the competition is tough there. It will be the Olympics, but it is within the GB setup just to just to reach the team in your division. You've put a real marker down today. Yeah, I'd, uh, from the start of the year really, I think I've, I've set my stall out for a for, um, place of 2012. Um, going from the two Opens to um, World and then now I just want to keep my form up. I know if I, if I perform well. I'll, I'll put in performances like that and t t to be honest today I didn't feel at my best, um, it was scrappy, I, I was a bit injured, um, I, I would have liked to have performed a bit better but um, I got the results at the end of the day and that, that's what counts at the end of it, um, so I'll go back now with a bit of a rest and then I think it's about 10 weeks to the French Open which is our next selection event and hopefully do well there and I'm just focusing on each tournament as it, as it comes, French is next, then it'll be I think Dutch or German so if I, if I put on performance like that, and um, like I have all year, then hopefully I'll be on that team. Where does a, a British title sort of rank in your, your achievements? Because obviously you've got the crowd there as well, and that's something you've got to get used to. Yeah, I'd, I'd, um, the first couple of fights, there was not many people there, to be honest. The atmosphere weren't that good, but then um, getting the quarters and the semis, a lot more people, and um, it, the atmosphere got up, and just every point I scored, there was a big roar behind me, and I, I, I love that, to be honest, I, that's why I do the sport, and I love people cheering me on, and um, in London, if I get there, it'll be 12,000 people, hopefully, all cheering for me, so it is um, a good title to win, I haven't won, it. I haven't medalled before, I've last year we, um, didn't go too well, and the uh, two years before that, I was in 63, um, and got to the quarters both times, so it's a, it's a big um, achievement for me. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you. you. Cheers. Thanks. Fantastic. Cheers. Thank you, Martin.